Endowed with reason, humanity is the pinnacle of nature. Because of this priceless gift, not only can we comprehend the information we receive from the world around us, we're able to analyze it and discover even those truths that nature has tried to conceal. Today, we are close to unraveling the greatest mystery in the world now that we have decoded the language of cells. A very smart man was interested by how beautifully all biological systems work, including the human body. And as a mathematician and a physicist, he doubted that this precision was controlled entirely by the nervous system and the various hormones and other substances that are secreted into the blood. This man was Professor Nikolai Devyatkov, our colleague here in Russia. He theorized that cells communicate by means of electromagnetic signals. But just imagine all the other sources of radiation, radio signals, the sun, if that was how cells communicated, we would be in serious trouble every time the sun hiccuped. The interference would be so strong that our cells simply would not be able to communicate along those channels. Then another theory was raised. Perhaps cells communicate using a totally unique system, and nature wisely invented a type of signal for these communications that is unknown outside the human body, a signal that is protected from all interference. That theory turned out to be right on target. It has already been proven that the cell membrane generates a particular extremely high frequency range. We've discovered that most diseases are caused by interrupted information exchange between organs. This disturbance of information exchange is the first indication of disease. When the normal transfer of information is interrupted, that creates chaos and disease. Based on this theory, it becomes obvious that in order to return the body to a state of harmony and health, one must restore order to the chaos. That is where extremely high frequency EHF radiation can be of assistance in medicine. 